what the Lehigh model does, it allows OPM to make those decisions simultaneously. So any group of inmates, whether it's 100 inmates or 1,000 inmates that we have to make a decision on placement for, it makes the best decision for the department at that point in time, uh, looking at all of those factors. At its very foundation, uh, the inmate assignment decision support system is a productivity enhancement tool. So it, it allows OPM to work and operate more efficiently. Um, and when we're looking at inmates' assignments, it, it takes into consideration uh, a multitude of factors that would have been virtually impossible for, for humans to do alone, uh, including program waiting times. Uh, and it decreases the amount of time uh, that an inmate waits to start programming. It also takes into consideration security concerns, such as gang-related security concerns, uh, inmate demographics, which can significantly reduce uh, assaults within our prison on our staff and our other inmates, and it overall increase our security in our facilities and public safety. So previously it took uh, OPM, the Office of Population Management, uh, 40 staff hours per person, seven people in the office, to evaluate and review the petitions and determine the appropriate placement uh, to the best that they could with the tools that they had. Now, with the inmate assignment tool, the inmate assignment decision support system, you can literally click a button and within uh, 30 seconds to a minute, all those decisions are made simultaneously. So it's, it's a tremendous productivity enhancement tool just for the office. So now the staff in OPM can evaluate things that they weren't previously able to do because of, of the time that they had to spend just reviewing the petition. Um, we've mapped out the entire process, the, the why do we make a decision for, for every possible factor. And the model takes all that into consideration and makes a simultaneous decision based on that. Yeah, this inmate assignment decision support system that was built by uh, Lehigh University has really been a godsend. Uh, and, and again, keep in mind that, uh, that one of our key goals is making preparing inmates to be successful for parole. The key, the key piece of that is that they complete programming. So making sure our program seats are full and making sure um, we have inmates completing their program by the time they're eligible for parole is a critical piece. This tool has really uh, allowed us to improve that and also um, allowed us to, to not increase staff in, in the department that supports it. So parole rate, uh, for one, um, with people completing programming at a higher rate by the time they're eligible for parole, that increases the parole rate. Also, um, the reduction in transports, um, and, and keep in mind, that's not just a cost savings, but that's a savings from a security standpoint, because transports are some of our riskiest things that we do. And also, you can make an argument that it has had some impact on us reducing violence by making better decisions as, as it relates to especially uh, gang members and younger inmates who are more likely to be violent. So, so we've saved money in all those areas. It's been uh, a pretty significant uh, success for us and for the taxpayers of Pennsylvania to the tune of about 2.9 million in the first year. And we're projecting uh, closer to 20 million over the, the next five years.